2020, we completed the priority new infrastructure segment of the Southwest Calgary Ring Road. So everything from Highway 8, Glenmore, all the way down to Fish Creek Boulevard. And that was the big push that we had to do for this year, with the deadline coming not at the end of the year, but on, on October 1st. To hit that deadline, we, in the very early springtime, started to make planning on construction scheduling and resource demand. Our superintendent and our project managers worked hard to bring in additional people, hire foremen, paving crews, bring in equipment, rent equipment, bring in another coal ass paving company, bring a crew down, working a lot of nights and a lot of time away from their family and everybody involved with the project, from plants to QC group that tripled in size this year, to the equipment haulers in the shop and to all four paving crews that worked regularly on the ring road, worked an incredible amount of time and effort to push us over the finish line and complete successfully and open on October 1st through some pretty good weather, which really cooperated with us to complete a record year for standard general asphalt placing. We had uh, the records pulled and we are the biggest asphalt paving year standard general's ever had. The reason that the project had two completion dates was for the areas that were transferred to the province by the Sutina and between Glenmore Trail and Anderson Fish Creek Boulevard. These are the areas that are part of the Taza development that's being driven by the Sutina and it includes the first Costco on a First Nations land in, in Canada. There's also opportunities further along the alignment both for, for residential development and for office space and cultural space that the Sutina are continuing to develop and we hope to have as Standard General and Colas a key part in, in continuing construction on that portion of their project. Working with KGL was a big learning curve for the Sutina Nation's contractors and also Sarsi Gravel. It helped us adjust and get comfortable with the growing industry in Alberta. Working with Standard General, however, was a real good learning experience. We learned from them. They helped us as the First Nations and helped us grow a little bit more. We hope to actually continue that relationship moving forward. In 2021, we still have around 130,000 tons of paving to put down to complete the remainder and tie the Southwest Ring Road into the Southeast Ring Road and into the uh, future West Calgary Ring Road. So the two extreme ends of the job will be completed next year. Be a very different year next year compared to this year with, with a target of 130,000 tons instead of 500,000 tons. But the October 1st deadline still remains. We're gonna push hard in the beginning of the year and try and wrap it up as, as quickly as we can and then take the resources and skills that we've built in this kind of project and put them to work on other projects, on other Alberta transportation projects, similar highway interchange construction, all the way down to City of Calgary work and, and hopefully participate in the TAZA developments as it continues.